Hi everyone, today we got another update. I know, they're coming in fast and furious, aren't they? They're not even a movie. <laughs> but what we've got today, we're going to have a look at. It is 2022.4.5. And I, for one, didn't think we were going to get it that quick. We were told it was in China and we've got it here in the UK. If you don't know what I'm talking about, we're going to look at it right now. Mal's back talking Tesla. To see the enhancements made to my Tesla and how to update yours, please subscribe to the channel and you can message me with suggestions or for help. OK, so let's pull up the nice notes that we have on the screen for the software. There we go. And look, you see here, there's something new. We're going to go into that. There's a new little thing. It's appeared just there. And also, look, we have now got Easy Entry is back on the screen. So loads of people have asked Elon, please can we have Easy Entry? Well, now you've got it. They're all there. And look, if you notice, I've added a new one somewhere. Where is it? Is it in F? Yes, look, under Filming Mode. If I hit that button, I can see the top screen of my camera. Yes, I know, I've added that one in. Right, so you've got that in there. Look, and if you can see, you've got easy entry in the old format where it was on all the other screens, but it's actually at the top. Now, in some of the models, they've got um, the dash cam on top as well. We haven't got that here in the UK, and we haven't got the uh, Wi-Fi on it. So if you want the Wi-Fi, you have to go into this mode here and go back and look for Wi-Fi settings. So we haven't got that in the UK, but in a couple of places in, in America, they have got that. So maybe they're gonna give us that on the next update, but they didn't include it in this one. But what did we get? Well, let's have a look. So we go into the notes and we'll wait to find them. Open up release notes. Is, so first thing we've got is three things we've got. Regenerative braking, number one. Number two, car colorizer yes that is something everyone wants we'll get into that shortly and save dash cam clips user interface improvements there they meant so let's dive right in so the first thing it says so pilot will now use more regenerative braking at low speeds for higher efficiency and improved driving experience well that's good for start especially in stop go traffic Increased use of regenerative braking results in less brake pedal noise and smoother stops. Well, that means they may stop phantom braking. We won't know this until I can get it out and try it. So that's something to test on another episode. Right, so there we have that one. Now, this is the one everybody's been going, can I have it? Colorization. And look, you've got a nice little wheel to play with. And it says, customize how your car appears on the touchscreen and mobile app with the car colorizer. Change the color of your car's exterior by tapping the controls software colorizer icon or using colorize in the toy box. So let's look at that, right? So let's dive right in. So in this mode here, which we are at the moment in, in the release notes, if we go back, uh, let's see if we can do this better. If we go here, back to software, there it is, this new thing here, look, so watch. It's like a little paint pot, actually. That's the way to describe it. You can now, look, here it is. So if I turn the wheel, look what's happened to the car. It's now a lovely shade of purple. And you can make it solid, which it is now, metallic. So it makes it there, or matte. And look, you see, it's dull. Now, there is one person <laughs> who will love this. That's Jack Massey Walsh. He's got a YouTube channel, which he does Teslas. And guess what? He's got a pink Tesla. Let's see if we can get a pink color to, to simulate his car. Um, here's all the primary colors. Let's put it back into solid. You see, oh, here, let's go. Oh, look. <laughs> He like that one. Look, white shades of power. You could play Purple Hiram, couldn't you? The white shade of power. Right, let's have that. There we go. Look, we can bring it over. Oh, look at that. Oh, it's so beautiful. There's the screen colour. I'm going to change it to red. It's instantaneous. Look, look, well, just to see. Look, green, 
one, two, three. About three second delay. Blue. And if you muck it all up, yes, you can go back to the paint pot and say, oh, I'll go back to my original colour. Boring blue. Oh, no. <laughs> but look, it's brilliant. You've got all these different colours. I tell you what, now I can add so many different colours into my thumbnails. When I want to just make a, a nice match red or that. And you can, you can fool people, can't you? Because you can say to someone, look, I've got a green car. And they go, oh, didn't you have a blue one before? He's like, yeah, well, the day before I had a red one. Did you? What was that like then? Oh, there you are. It's now red. Oh. <laughs> before your very eyes. Another thing to tell you is, look, you can have as many as six colours of different colours that you'd like to have as your selection, but you've only got your original one there that doesn't get affected. So if you want to go back to blue, you're back to blue. If you want to go to a shade of turquoise colour or any of the pretty colours now you can do everything you want and there's one more thing I've noticed the charge you know normally they put it in a peculiar place on the navigation and people have asked can we have it back where it used to be it's now back where it used to be what do I mean let me show you it's now back where in a rightful place look here now as all your charging Instead of having to go for you, you used to have to go somewhere up on the navigation. If you went into navigation here, it's also here as well. Look, so they've given you it in two places. It's there and it's here. So save dash cam. Let's read that. So it says, quickly save dash cam clips by adding the dash cam icon to the bottom bar. Simply long press any app icon to enter edit mode, then drag dash cam to the bottom bar for quick access. Tap the dash cam icon to manually save the clips. You can now drag it, so we're gonna go to it. So first of all, we put it on the three little dots. There's the dash cam. So we're gonna move it out into the bar and it's there to start driving. So let's just put it into gear. It's like my red car. <laughs> okay, we're in. And let's see. Saving dash cam clips. That's how you do it. That's the way to do it. So there you go. Look at that. Wow. Just like that, you just hit the save the dash cam clip and it's done. And one other thing that it said, which I'm going to now show you, is to do the colorization from the toy box. So we go to toy box, and remember the light show was the first one, now colorizer is the first one. Look, hit that and you're back in. And it shows a representation of work. Those would be great. If they'd have made those colors work like that, but it doesn't. So, customize. So this is a representation screen. You can't do anything with this screen until you hit customize. Now you have it. Now we can, it remembers where we were last with the green one. We can go back to Jack Mackey, Messy Walsh's pink. And isn't it good? Tesla's listening. So suddenly they're adding in all of these little things back that we asked for. So we asked for the easy entry. We've now got it. We asked for dash clips to become good. Now I know that people have been asking for the heater. It is a bind. There's no easy way around it at the moment except by voice. You can't see what it's, what, the, what it's doing without actually turning on the heater, which is pretty stupid if you think about it. The idea of not turning on your heater was to save your battery. And they reckoned the heated seats don't draw much power. And what they done, they made you put your heated seats on. I know, stupid, isn't it? <laughs> While putting on the blower. I know, very silly. But what can you do? They're getting it right. So on future updates, there will be some more things. I didn't think we were going to get so quick because they said it was only in China and that it would come to the U US at some point, but it came to the UK. Yes, thumbs up. And talking of thumbs up, if you want to be one of my followers, please do. I have, look, these are going to the post office today. Two more prizes are going out. One is going to Canada to the electric man. He's getting his today, so that's going to be posted out. And the other one is Minda. Minda's going to get his. 
and he's a new owner. So he's gonna be buying the car and he gets this prize, which I'm gonna tell you what it is because it is great. I'm doing lots of light shows now. I have one of the biggest collections at the moment. I know there's gonna be someone's one more, but I don't think so, because I've got most of them. I've got, at the moment, currently, there's 223 light shows, all on one USB. Some lucky person, well, two are getting that, and there'll be some more coming out. So get in quick. If you haven't subscribed, hit that subscribe button. You could be fast-tracked into the prize now, because the computer does seem to be saying Minda was brand new, I shoved him in, and he came up, boom, straight away, he got it. I couldn't believe it, I, I rang him. And said, anyway, <laughs> you've, you've subscribed, but you've got in. And he went, no, I haven't. I said, yeah, I haven't got the car yet. I'm gonna buy the car now. He certainly is. Right, so there you are, get in quick. Get in that, hit that subscribe button. You go in for a chance. You could be getting, instead of mucking around, putting a light show on one USB and that, Mal's done it for you, the lot. And I'm doing on daily basis. So it's two, <laughs> it's 2.23 at the moment. It could well be 2.30 by tomorrow. So you could get that. So it is gonna be something worth having. Some are coming on key sticks and some are coming on USBs. And on here, you can probably get about 250 because this is a, a two gigabyte. The um, other stick is, is a four gigabyte. So there's the choices. They're coming right up. You get a choice of colors and it's posted out to you. But a couple actually, uh, Goodwill people, Shiva actually said to me, look, I don't want you to post it out to me. Um, very nice offer. I wouldn't use it. I'm really pleased with it. I love your channel. I like watching it and give it to someone else. So it's back in the drawer. Someone else, it could be you, will get it. Anyway, enough of that. I hope you've enjoyed this uh, update and look forward to seeing you on the next one. Until then, I'll be seeing ya. Thanks for watching and do tell us in the comments section that you subscribed and we can then contact you if you're the winner when the prize is drawn. Quack, quack. Oops.